Okay guys, I am working outside. It's a beautiful sunny day and I took down all the Christmas. Put the Irish flag up. Put that beautiful metal bunny right there. Look at him. He's so awesome. And what else? I got new little cactuses for those. Put the other little wind spinner over there. <sighs> Put that there. Love that. Very nice. The other St. Pat's flags over there. Picked up about 50 million branches. Raked some leaves. This is all uh, for the garbage on Monday. Now, I'm taking a break because I'm killing my back. Um, taking a quick break because I'm putting together this storage container thing and it is insane to put together. But I'm putting it right over here and it's going to... I'm almost done. I just got to attach the lid. But uh, it's going right here. And this is where I'm going to store all of my, my big pumpkins and stuff like that. This thing was a bitch to put together. It is not like the one on the other side, which was just snapped together. This one is screws and oh, it's hell. <laughs> Absolute hell. So... Getting everything ready for the spring. However, all right, today's going to be 55. Tomorrow is going to be 58. But then we're going to have a snowstorm on Sunday. What the hell? They tease us, you know? I don't know. So, getting everything ready. Everything is very muddy, as you can see. That's why I have my hunter boots on. Because you can see all the mud here from the melting snow. But uh, pretty soon, I feel pretty soon. But I want to be partly there, you know, when the weather really gets nice. So I don't have that much to do. I want to put all my pumpkins away because I have a lot of them and I love them. I'm going to put them all in that storage box and anything else that'll fit. And I got rid of the any of the plants that were you know out here all winter that I needed to uh, get rid of like that one I get, I get new ferns every year this one here um, will have a new fern on it and that's about it for now got a lot of sweeping to do I got a lot of leaf blowing in the little corners of the deck uh, a lot of washing everything off for the season. That won't come till uh, it's, you know, warm enough to hang out here. So, gonna finish that. And then I'm gonna have a cup of coffee. And just rest my back for a little bit. And then I'll see what else I might want to do today. Definitely not putting the swing stand up yet because, uh, no, not for having a snowstorm. So, anyway, guys, just want to give you an update. Almost done with this horrendous <laughs> nightmare of a project. My neighbor uh, gave me some of these green bricks to uh, just to keep it off the ground. This green paver thing, so that'll be good. There's a lot of room in there, so looks a bit like a coffin, doesn't it? So that's it. I'm just so happy for some nice weather to get cleanup started. Very excited. Everything on the fence survived and looks good. There were a couple of things that were already getting really beat up anyway. And some things freeze and thaw and crack or whatever. So, uh, 
this stuff is all going. That goes out Monday. So, that's it for me. I'm going to get back to work. And I will be back with you later. Have a fun day. a little too windy to do any more uh, yard cleanup today because the leaves just blow right back and uh, so I'm not gonna go there today but here's all the muddy footprints um, yeah I'll wait till we have a nice warm stretch a nice still day I'm gonna fix this eagle here it's a little crooked Ugh, I can't fix them. Oh, I'm gonna get the damn ladder. All right. So all the pumpkins are put away. And they fit great. They fit really good with much room to spare so I'm pretty happy about that this one has like a hydraulic opener which is really cool so all the pumpkins fit in there and there's plenty of extra space so pretty happy about that so glad that damn thing is together oh my god okay so yeah, lots of cleanup. I, I'm not even going to bother uh, blowing the leaves off the deck yet because they're just going to blow back on me. And uh, I'm going to need a nice still day to do that so I only have to rake them once. But as you can see, Almost there. Almost there for the season. Just have to uh, do some more yard cleanup and blow off the deck. Find places for our new stuff. Get rid of the pile of garbage. Hello. I'm just waiting for it to get warm and stay warm. Yeah. I'll see you later, Derek. What's the matter with you, Wedge? You always bark at him. You always bark at him. He's gone. He's gone. Sorry, babe. I can't let you out there. It's too muddy in the back, okay? I'll be done shortly. Watch out. Go. Hi, guys, and happy Friday. I hope you're having a beautiful Friday. I had a couple of very busy days. Yesterday I took all the Christmas stuff down from outside. All the Christmas decorations uh, came down yesterday. And because it was the first like warm, pretty warm day. 
and today was a little bit warmer and tomorrow's gonna be even warmer but today being as it was so warm it's supposed to be so warm I put together the I started the yard cleanup I put together the new um, storage box so that I could put away all the pumpkins all my big uh, so, you know heavy pottery pumpkins got that done it was not easy and um, I didn't do anything else after I was finished outside today because I literally can't I can barely walk I can I killed my back and my hips are just uh, bending up and down to put that thing together oh my god lifting the pieces oh, screwing everything oh, it was it was hell it was hell um, you like to believe that you can do everything like you once could, <laughs> but uh, obviously I, I can't. I, I need to limit myself. So um, anyway, I got a lot done today and I got done what I wanted to get done anyway. Uh, then the wind started to whip up, so it was like getting like a little annoying actually to be out there. Um, so yesterday, took the Christmas stuff down stopped in the Passaic Thrift and then hung out with Craig. And Craig gave me, um, he did a Monsterville number three, we're on the third um, uh, volume already. And he put some really good things on there, a couple of them I'm looking for on 45 already. So, very, very fun. <clears throat> um, so yesterday I found some really fun things. I found this beautiful um, wicker and iron planter thing, vase thing, with grapes and vine. And uh, this will also be for the deck this year. And I got these flowers in the Dollar Tree to go in it. I also found this really cool little planter and it's, a, it's all bark. And I love these natural looking things. Just beautiful. Very happy. Um, I also found this little guy. Oh my God, look how cute this is. He's from Utah. The company that makes him is from Utah. Uh, it's called Intermountain gift makers in Pleasant Grove, Utah. But I love the shape of his body and he's all corduroy and he's got the cutest face ever. Look at that and his little feet. Just so cute. He's going to go on my bed against the pillows with, um, with my big Pooh Bear. So precious. Um, I found these. I found two of these Jemmy um, Christmas things. This one is Rudolph. They're on little, uh, they look like magic carpets to me, but of course they're supposed to be sleds. And this one is Frosty. Frosty the snowman was a jolly happy soul. With a corn cup pipe and a button nose and two eyes made out of coal. Frosty the snowman is a fairy tale they say. He was made of snow but the children know how he came to life one day. So precious. And these Jemmy things, um, there is a huge um, collector's community of these things. So one day, like, they'll be 
the hot Christmas item like the mid-century stuff is now. Um, what else did I get over there? I got... I got these. Oh my god, I haven't seen these in years. And I used to live in these things. And these are my favorite color. Um, in shoals. They are real old. The real shoals. Look at that. In red. In my size. And I'm telling you, I used to live in these things. I love shoals. I haven't seen them in years. So I was pretty happy about those. Um, and I found this beautiful thing. Because we're going to make um, nachos on Super Bowl Sunday. And I thought this would be great for nachos. It's a big clay dish. And uh, you have these two handles to get it in and out of the oven. I love that. This is the perfect dish for nachos, I think. Right? I loved it. So that was my thrift store. Oh, oh, and then I got this very strange, very, very creepy uh, CPR baby. Oh my god. It's right there. But I'm going to put a picture of her right here. All right, I got an eBay thing, and that was the 1948 version of Cootie. Oh my god, I got that toy book, and I said, oh my god, Cootie, I forgot all about it. It's complete, can you see that? 100% complete, really beautiful. I can't wait to play this. I'll bring this with me on Sunday. And Peter, my friend Peter gave me um, the Sound and Vision, Bowie Sound and Vision box set on CD. It is beautiful. This thing is really beautiful. Like I said, I wanted this on LP, but it was just uh, on the LP set, but it just was too much money. So he gave me that. Loved it. Uh, what else? Tomorrow, I'm taking my dad to the IMAX to see the Beatles um, get back the rooftop concert. I am so excited. I was watching uh, videos of some people that have already gone and um, in the lobby they gave out like um, IMAX, the IMAX film poster. They gave out um, like a VIP lanyard pass kind of thing and um, just really cool and it was at the the giveaways were at the location that I'm going to so I'm really hoping that they still have those um, the person that uh, did the video went on on the first day on opening day which was the exact date 53 years to the day that the Beatles actually did the concert and it of course was their last concert so uh, I don't know if that was just for the first day or if it's all the time I don't know I have to find out because Peter and Craig are going tonight and um, I gotta ask them tomorrow if uh, they got those things because that'll be cool so I did a lot of work today. I did a lot of yard cleanup. I did a lot of raking. Uh, I picked up about 50,000 branches. I, there were so many branches in the yard after the windstorms and the winter. I picked them all up. That's, that's basically that and building the box are what really killed my back. Because branches, you got to bend over, pick them up put them in the back. Oh, just so much work. But um, when it's really nice out, when it really gets nice, because think about it, today it was 55, tomorrow's going to be 58. Sunday we're going to have another snowstorm. Like what is going on? And 
we still have to get through March and you got the March winds blow kind of thing you know what I mean so it's it's not time yet but I'm taking advantage of this warm weather to get things done so that I'm almost ready to go when the weather gets beautiful then I'll just have to do certain things and I'll be you know set like I can't put any of the new stuff out yet it's still winter and um, those will all have to wait but I'm feeling that if we got a couple of days like this in February we'll get even more in March hopefully and then uh, before you know it spring will be here so I can't wait so I think that's it guys I I didn't go thrifting today and I didn't go by Craig's like I said I, I can barely walk <laughs> I got a crippled old lady um, I didn't finish outside I was outside from about 7 to 1 so that's really too late for me to go to the thrift anyway that's when they get crowded and all the good stuff is gone anyway and um, uh, after I took a shower I was gonna go by Craig's but I'm telling you I just I can't I can't I just have to relax so just playing music and hanging out trying to get my back to feel better um, it'll feel better hopefully by tomorrow but you know tomorrow all we have to do is sit in a comfortable theater chair <laughs> and uh, I'll be fine um, just so happy to have that box put together I I thought it would be like my other one like an easy snap together thing oh no oh no 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 it was very complicated <laughs> and um, I would love to put my swing uh, hanger together but I it's too early I, uh, there's no way that I need to do that I can't anyway right now but uh, when we get closer to spring we will do that so I think that's all guys I don't have that much uh, to talk about but after I go see the uh, Beatles show I will um, give you my review let you know what I thought of it um, IMAX films are fun they're great but they make me incredibly dizzy so um, but like um, Peter said it's not uh, motion you know it's not a lot of motion like some of those ocean ones and uh, um, we went to one that was like Mario Andretti I think it was called speed oh my god I was getting so seasick uh, both of those films just makes me too dizzy but um yeah uh, still people not moving I mean the screen not moving people standing on stage um, should be fine. I should be fine with that. <laughs> so anyway, guys, I hope you're having a magical, mystical, musical Friday. If you if you're still working, it's the end of your work week. Yay! Um, this weekend is Super Bowl Super Bowl weekend. If you give a shit about that, I, I really don't. But my mother does. Craig does. Peter does. Skeety doesn't really care. He's not big on that anymore. Uh, but anyway, my mother's really big on it, so <laughs> I'll make her the nachos and I'll bring the cootie game. I don't think the Super Bowl starts till nighttime anyway. And then we have Valentine's Day on Monday. It's already Valentine's Day. Um, the time is going very fast, isn't it? It's going really fast. That's why I'm confident that before we know it, it's going to be spring. And it'll be warm, and we'll be sitting outside. I can't wait. So, again, magical, musical, mystical Friday. Comment, subscribe, spread that love. Tink merch below, Radio Tink podcast link below. Follow Radio Tink on Facebook. And until next time, remember, I love you and appreciate each and every one of you from my heart to yours.
See you soon. <laughs>